Now we know that Veridap fuel management hardware is lab tested to extremes, but how extreme is too extreme? In the test lab, they smash a five kilogram weight into the touchscreen glass over and over, but it just bounces off. To test for dust ingress, the screens are bombarded with very fine corn flour. The screen is absolutely caked in flour. Dusty, but still working. They shock and vibrate the screen on this electrodynamic shaker up to 15 Gs, but nothing seems to stop this hardware from working. But we know where you work is as down and dirty as it gets. Your work takes you from the dusty outback to steamy Asian jungles, and sometimes all the way to the frozen Arctic. So let's put a Veridap screen through hell. Look at all this mud. This screen needs a cold shower. Hmm, kind of satisfying, isn't it? In mining, heavy vibration comes with a job. So we tested the Veridap hardware in the most brutal way we could find. Let the torture begin. But the Veridap screen takes the punishment like a champ. But what about rocks and debris? We test for that too. The screen is protected by six millimeter thick glass designed to withstand the impact of a high pressure nozzle strike. So we think it's only right to blast the Veridap screen with a flamethrower. Talk about under fire, the screen is on fire. Now that's one tough piece of hardware. Veridap, built tough, built to last.